Hey, I decided to make a new video of the house at Lake Wind in Douglasville because when I was here the first time they were doing some work on the house so I thought I'd run inside for you um, to see if they finished the work and what it ended up looking like. Um, just to remind you, it's in a cul-de-sac. It's actually on the corner of the cul-de-sac. There's a house across the street for sale to you that I'm going to go check out when I'm done here. But let's go in. Split foyer. And this house has a big foyer. See, there's a whole area over here behind the front door um, that you can go to. It has new carpeting, vaulted family room. It does have the split bedroom plan that you like. Open concept to the kitchen. So they have finished the work. It has light wood floors. The cabinets have been painted, but they haven't put any pulls on them. I don't know if they're planning on doing that. Um, it doesn't have a hard surface countertop, but it looks to be in good shape. The stove still pulled out a little has a new microwave, there's a refrigerator, it has a pantry. Now I remember this house. It's the one that had the bench right here in the corner so you can put a table right here. Um, and then here's the vaulted living room. Nice size master. Here's the bathroom, it has tall floors, same kind of counters, countertops. Separate double shower, garden tub, walk-in closet, decent size. Um, then across to the other rooms, here's one. This is a good size room, actually. And then there's the closet. And then over here is the other one. I think this one might be just a tad smaller, but it looks out over the backyard. This is the house that I didn't really go out in the backyard because it was really muddy that day. But it needs some landscaping. But it would be a good backyard if it had, had a little more grass. And then here's the bathroom. It has a new toilet. They haven't put some of the stuff back up, but they've got the cabinets back on. To be honest, whoever painted the cabinets didn't do a very good job. They used matte paint. They didn't put any sealer on the top of it, so it needs to be redone. But there's carpet down into the basement. When you get to the bottom of the steps, you, the laundry is right in front of you, which is nice. And then you're immediately in one big room with double windows, large room. And then back here is a bedroom. This would be perfect for your mom. This is a big space because this is a big bedroom. Has its own closet. And then you can access this bathroom, which has the same kind of finishes as upstairs. Um, you can access this full bathroom. They put all new toilets in this house and sinks. Um, and then go right back out to that big living area space. I don't know if why or if you didn't like this house the first time I sent it to you. I don't think we ever talked about it after I sent the video. So I just assumed you didn't like it. There's the two car garage. And then it has this platform built up all around the edge, which is great storage space. There's a workbench area. Let me go out in the back and then I'll come down here and take pictures of the appliances to see how old they are. This is tile, by the way, on the floor when you come in the foyer. And the carpet that's in here is kind of a grayish tan color, actually, so it'd probably go with just about any furniture. 
The deck is painted, but some of the wood might need to be replaced soon. Some pieces of the wood on the deck. But it does have steps down to the back porch. I mean, to the backyard. And all of this where these trees are, this woods, that's part of the property and the side yard over there. So, if you could get your grass to grow like your next door neighbors, this would be a nice backyard. It's not too close to anything. There's a door to a crawl space down there. The gutters and the roof and the siding looks really good. I mean, it looks to be in good shape. A um, few things on the deck, like I said, a few of those pieces of wood. Um, and I would put some another coat of paint on all these cabinets and then put some sealer on them before I put any pulls on it. And then here's the front door. All those beautiful windows. And that's it. I'm going to go take pictures of everything in case you guys like it.